we talked about this over and over and over. You know, Roman's a champion that's always, you know, taking his breaks ever since he became the, the, the unified champ. Prior to that, he was a fighting champ. He fought a lot more often. I mean, just about, what, every month, every week or whatnot. Kind of like what Seth has done. He didn't defend the title a whole lot, but he was definitely in, you know, those matches and promos. And he was always, he was definitely always on SmackDown. Roman was at that point in time. And I, and I know it's okay for people to take months off and come back, you know, especially in, in combat sports in general. It happens all the time and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. But I truly hope that they have a real uh timeline for damian priest not that he has to cash before mania or has to be rushed but i felt like this was his moment to truly shine and you know get the big bad heel pop now am i totally mad that he didn't cash in not really i can't say that i'm like i'm, I'm a little disappointed more than i am mad this is a real injury. This is a serious injury. Obviously, Seth Rollins is, is already announcing he's going to be at WrestleMania. But to me, personally, the promo that they opened up Raw with, not that he had to relinquish the title or get cashed in on, but it felt real for the very beginning portion of it. And then it started to kind of fall off the rails towards the back end. Especially when he got interrupted by Gunther. They didn't even come out to attack him. They didn't come out with any motive other than, hey, I'm joining the Rumble. And if I win the Rumble, I'm cashing it. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm picking you. That's who I'm cashing it in on. I'm cashing in the Rumble on you. And I, I just... I don't know. I just felt like it was very kindergarten, very, you know, it was like a nursery rhyme. No, it, when I come back, I'm going to be healthy and I'm going to, you know, be careful who you're coming with. No, you be careful who's coming after you. And I respect you because you're a fighting champion just like me. And no, you know what? I respect you too. No, you. No, you, you, me, you, who, me, where? Yeah, yeah. Me, me times three. <laughs> exactly. I'm going to fight you Sunday at the Rumble. I mean, I'm going to fight on the Rumble on Sunday, and I'm winning the Rumble, and I'm choosing you. So, again, not that he needed to get cashed in on, not that he needed to relinquish the belt, I get that he's trying to come back. They are clearly set on trying to help him return ASAP. They're clearly set on him facing, you know, whoever they may have in mind. I know we're all saying it's a given CM Punk, but honestly, it could be it could be anybody, right? And I just when you're intercontinental champion, I want them to focus on the intercontinental championship. I've never liked the idea of an intercontinental champion joining the Rumble or those number one contender tournaments to then hopefully go for the main belt. Like, to me, it's just like, I know Seth was the main champ and U.S. champ at the same time at one point, but I just, you know, I, am, am I glad that they didn't strip him? Yes. In that regard, I am glad that they didn't strip him for sure. But I can't say that I'm as glad about Damian not cashing in, honestly. Because because you got the, the WrestleMania is happening in April. And then like, uh, what, like a month and a half or two months later, you have money in the bank. So Damian Priest, what, he's not going to cash in between now and Mania? And he's going to have to, he has two months to cash in the belt? Like, it's going to feel rushed anyways. Honestly, think he's losing that briefcase. I yeah, think I think he's going to lose the briefcase too unless, like I said, bro, they have something already set up where they know who's going to be the one facing Seth 
and they know when he's going to cash in the the money in the bank. Mm. This was like this was life as a Sammy fan last year. Yeah, I mean, you could say that. But we'll see, man. I I'm I'm not really even bashing WWE for now stripping him or getting cashed in on. Again, I'm focusing on how terrible the back end of that exchange was where Seth really was going nowhere fast, gets interrupted by Gunther only to really say that he's fighting at the Rumble on Sunday. person to do that with. Like Seth's got history with, I know Cody and Punk are doing something later, but one of them, like Punk saying, ah, well, you were worried about me ruining the company, but look at you letting the company down in the biggest moment, or yeah, having Cody come out, ask him, are you really going to let this be the finish of your story? Like, exactly. Like, oh, no, it just felt like Gunther was just random. Exactly. It felt random, but felt I- very generic, and I feel like Triple H has had better better moments. <laughs> But I honestly think, this is my opinion, I honestly think that Gunther was going to win the Rumble before Puck even came back. If it wasn't for Puck coming back, I think Gunther would have won the Rumble. Yeah, but Gunther needs to drop that Intercontinental belt. I don't know how he wins the Rumble and still has the Intercontinental yeah. title, honestly. No, nah, really? I think he's probably dropping that to Gable. Gable would have been there, most likely. Yeah, I wish Gable, Gable. would have won it. So, so yeah. That, that's my two cents, guys. I just wanted to kind of share how I felt about that. I just wanted a little more meat, you know, considering that Triple H has spoiled us so much. And he's always giving us long-term booking. And, 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 I, and I get it. They, they used it for the spotlight to be shined on Gunther. And I like Gunther, but um, I just, come on, man. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. I felt like it was just really watered down. So... Hit me up in the comment section. How do you guys feel about Seth Rollins uh, pretty much announcing he will be at Mania as champion? Not dropping the belt, not getting cashed in on. Did you see what I put in the chat? 